Good evening, everyone. This is Lolly. I wanted to show you today how I store my embossing powders, mini inks, and uh, pearl pigments. And you'll notice that my hands are, are blue and pink and all sorts of pretty colors from doing some mixed media. So um, a lot of my craft storage and my sewing storage is actually not from craft stores or geared for crafters. It's usually in the area where you would find storage for hardware items like nuts, bolts, screws, fishing tackle, and things like that. Um, I found that whenever you find good storage, but they design it for crafters, um, they jack the price up two to three times what you can get at like a hardware type store. So this is by Plano, and I've had this for a long time, so I doubt you can find this exact model. I'll put it on its back. See, this is what the side looks like from the front, I mean. And there are bins in here. I'm going to readjust my camera angle and show you um, each one of these, what's inside. Hold on. Okay, so... In the first one here, I have my first two tub of embossing powders. Now I used to be a demonstrator for Close to My Heart back when it was called DOTS, which stood for Dozens of Terrific Stands. We're talking about like 1995 <laughs> before they came up with their Close to My Heart line. And so I have a lot of embossing powders from, from, that, from that era that are still I'm still using. And you see I'm running really low. It says DOTS embossing powder. Anyway, I store them upside down so I can see what color they are, except for the ones that are particular, that uh, they look too much like other ones, and I wouldn't know what they were. And that gorgeous periwinkle there. So that's those. I have another one of just embossing powders, because we also used to have an amazing stamping store in town that closed its doors, but they came up with their own line of embossing powders, and so I got a lot of really beautiful colors like terracotta. Anyway, so that's my second one, and I keep um, the little miniature, like, color box, cat size, and ink it, uh, ink pads in that one, and in the bottom one, I keep the, these are all my pearl pigments, so I've got Perfect Pearls by Ranger, I don't even know what brand these are, hmm, I just, I had no, I, I don't know, I've had them for a long time. These ones are radiant pearls, and they are uh, more of a pasty kind instead of a powder. So, beautiful. Um, I just love these cases, and I can just keep so much in them. Just love, uh, love the storage idea. Thank you so much for watching. Hope you can find yourself some fishing tackle boxes and things like that that might work for you.